are listening to the Latin Jazz Show with Sweet Louis Bailando Casino from Alberto Alvarez. Also, La Mujer de Antonio, that's from Carlos Embales. Also heard Catalina from Ulises y Papines and Descarga con Ruben Gonzalez. This is Willie Rodriguez for the Latin Jazz Show, the Latin Jazz Show on WCLM 1450 AM radio and the Latin Jazz Show dot net. out to Mr. Ray Linquist. Ray Linquist of the Moogly Blues Band. Poppy, this one's for you, babe.
cariñito Mira morena cuando baila tú me quemas Eo, eo Dámelo ya, dámelo ya, ya me derrito CLM 1450 AM Highland Springs, Virginia and uh, Sweet Lou's in the pit uh, just mixing it up uh, uh, awesome music as usual you got David Aponte on the right on my right here that's uh, involved with all the uh, uh, wires man and we got us live streaming with video on radio a combination that we are debuting this we're the only ones that have it and it's really awesome to to uh, uh, be part of this historical time at the Latin Jazz Show, where this is vi we're video streaming, we're we're doing uh, audio, all right, and video at the same time, and it's just an awesome thing. Lou, I tell you, man, you know, are you just getting younger doing this or what? Well, I'm having a great time doing it. You know, we do this as a labor of love. This is not commercial radio. <laughs> This is Latin Jazz and Salsa Radio, the Latin Jazz Show, WCLM Radio, 1450 on your AM dial. Go to www.thelatinjazzshow.net. Click on the live audio and video, and you can put a face to the voice and a voice to the name. Como esta mi gente? We love you out there, man. Que pasa? You know, <laughs> que pasa? <laughs> mi gente, you're going to see a video coming up right now with Tito Puente. And this video is the last video before the legendary Tito Puente and percussionist passed away. We love you, Tito. And uh, and what is that video? Is that going to be Ran Can Can? Well, the last concierto, el concierto, Tito uh, Puente, and it's a place that we all uh, uh, went to when we were young, Gur, uh -huh. all right, oh. the Manhattan Center ah. in New York City. In well. <laughs> April 8, 19th of 2000, this commemorated edition DVD is the last live performance of the king of Latin music, Mr. Tito Puente. And we're going to be playing uh, Mambo Gozón and Ran Can Can by Tito Puente. Musica, hold maestro. On, hold on. Wait a minute, we got a caller. Hello, you're on the air. Talk to us. Hello, Hello you're on the air. Cogieron miedo esa gente. Go ahead, papi. Okay, well, without further ado, David Aponte, the last concierto de Tito Puente. What is that? Um, uh, Mambo Corazón y Gran Can Can. Música, maestro. 
por favor. Wow. Los bailarines Eric Torres Dances. ¡Qué chévere! ¡Qué chévere! Bien ensayado y todo. Vamos a hacerle un número especial ahora para la audiencia. El número se llama, y vamos a tener los muchachos zapateando a Gran Can Can. Fíjate qué fenómeno. Dale, Eric.
pero que ranca, can, pero que ranca, can. Are you ready? Are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tony Swift. One, two, three, four. Can you get better than that, ladies and gentlemen? That was Tito Puente live at Manhattan Center, and that was the last performance he gave before the legendary percussionist passed away, and we just listened to Ran Can Can, and that, he was still on the top of his game when he went up. You know what I mean, yeah, Mike? Did, uh, listen, the guy didn't get old. He got young. You right? know what I mean? The, 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 the people that he attracted 
were younger and younger and younger and younger mm -hmm. and, and, and uh, ever since he passed away, uh, his son has been continuing the legacy. That's right. Tito Puente Jr. Yeah. But uh, uh, the Manhattan Center, my goodness gracious, I was 17, 18 years old when I snuck in there, you know. That was and at the uh, turn of the century. Right, yeah, that was in early, er, 18, <laughs> 1898, but I eat. Paul's teeth were made out of wood in those you, days. You know what I anyway. mean? Anyway. <laughs> But uh, it, it, it's it's a, it's a it's magic. It's what it is. This is magic, and uh, to bring this kind of of uh, of of show to the general public, and and David was just sharing with me that I was last week I was at a family thing, and uh, as a result of all this additional stuff, as the the show grows, the the listening audience on the UStream has tripled, and, uh, uh, and uh, we had. Uh, I understand 4,000, 5,000 people, and uh, it's growing as we speak. Uh, remember that this is the Latin Jazz Show, WCNM 1450 AM, and you can call us. We want to hear from you at 804-231-7685-804-231-7685. And Sweet Lou is going to continue spinning from the pit and playing some stuff, man. It's, it might as well just keep it going, Lou. Well, the you next uh, the next uh, selection of music... Is sent in by our partner and brother, Mr. Willie Don Pepping de la Salsa, all the way from New York City, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, we never know what he's going to send, but he usually sends some fantastic music. And I want to remind everyone, this is not corporate tel uh, radio or corporate uh, TV, as they say. This is a, a labor of love that we do here on the Latin Jazz Show every Friday from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. And no hay otra emisora que toca el tipo de música que se oye aquí. Uh, we do it for the love of the music and the love of sharing our culture and our music and our style with anyone and everyone who's willing to listen to it and now see it on Ustream TV, www.thelatinjazzshow.net. This show is produced and sponsored by Master and Sons Plumbing, second generation of fine service. Let the masters do it right. 804-323-0202, 323-0202. If you want the job done, hey, call Master and Sons Plumbing. Your plumbing and drain cleaning experts, masterandsonsplumbing.com. No se olviden a llamar su plomero latino preferido, 804-323-0202, 323-0202. Trabajo con garantía, 24 horas al día. Master and Sons Plumbing, your plumbing and drain cleaning experts, masterandsonsplumbing.com. And we also uh, are sponsored by none other than Community Investment Syndicate. And Community Inv Investment Syndicate has launched 2012 with four different businesses under that umbrella. One is the uh, Commercial Loan Division, headed up by Major Robinson and James Lord from New York, which is actually doing this thing through computers. He'll be here next week. He may even come to the station. Also, no credit check financing, which is done out of uh, Ohio, and uh, we're going to still continue to do that. We're doing that uh, m half of a year last year. The uh, residential loans, once again, is launched out of Com Community Investment Syndicate's office, and uh, a great time to refinance, a great time to purchase. The, the, mm -hmm. the rates are, are real low, and the housing market is booming because the buying a house, is you can get a half a million dollar house for a quarter million dollars. And so it's really, really working out real good. So don't forget, Community Investment Syndicate at 804-914-1944. Su compañía de hipoteca is back. 804-914-1944. Want to also mention that Miss Hispanic Teen 2012, Miss is Hispanic Dad, brought to you by ASA, Hispanic American Sports Academy. And this is going to be an event starting from March 3rd all the way through to uh, August of the 4th until we have the crowning of Mrs. Manida. This is for young ladies between the ages of 13 and 17, high school age and high school students only. Uh, so if you want more information about the Miss Hispanidad 2012, you can call Miss Jackie Kemper at 245-7708 or Mr. Juan Tejada, who is the president of the organization, at 804-677-8000. And uh, we're still receiving applications for young ladies. We have over 15 already. You want to get up to about 25. And, of course, 
the Latin Jazz Show, as always, are going to be there, not only supporting but participating in the event. Well, that's what we do. We, uh, we, 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 we're, we're part of the community, and the community is part of us. So without further ado, from Sweet Lou, he's going to bring you a selection by Don Pepin de la Salsa, uh, debuting, actually, and this is basically raw footage of his show that he's presenting, and it's the Latin Jazz Show, uh, Willie's Collection, as he calls it. And this uh, uh, CD that he sent in is a compilation of music that he is uh, debuting with. And he said, uh, this is you know a rough copy, so let's listen to it and let's see what we can get. Because you know that if Don Pepe is involved, the music is going to be awesome. What do you say, Lou? Yes, uh, it's going to be fantastic. We also have River City Communications. If you want audio, video design, home theater, plasma installation, video surveillance, computer network, sales and service, residential, commercial, license and insured, call Mr. David Aponte, uh, operations manager, 804-304-9590, 304 uh, River City Communications, for the best in your audio, video, and security, call David Aponte, 304 304- 9590. Also, want to give a shout out to Mr. Hector Madina. Hector Madina, who's staying in contact with us via the Ustream live chat here and social stream and on Facebook. And he wants to remind us March 25th, March 25th, Dia, de la Sal- Dia Nacional de la Salsa at uh, Hiram Bethune Stadium in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Don't miss that. Hector Medina with March 25th, Dia Nacional de la Salsa, Hiram Bethune, Be, excuse me, Bethune Stadium in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Just a little bit of how we're reaching out to all the brothers. And Hector says, blessings to all of you. Last Sunday in Salinas at, Tono, at, at the Tonito Lady Tribute. Awesome. Thank you, Hector, for your information and for listening into the Latin Jazz Show. And as always, we start the music with Willie's Collection, Musica, Maestro, por favor.
Si ese negrito supiera que cuando voy por su calle el corazón se me sale del pecho cuando lo veo. Si lo supiera ese negro, ay, si lo supiera.
www.thelatinjazzshow.net This is a runoff, a spinoff with uh, Lou's blessing and Miguelito's blessing. We're going into a new era. I will be doing a weekly show uh, in the future. Uh, The name will be Willie's Collection. Um, And uh, uh, it's my first uh, attempt. This is just a preview. The music is great so far. We're going to keep going. And uh, remember, listen to the Latin Jazz Show every Friday from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. on WCLM 1450 AM in Richmond, Virginia, and thelatinjazzshow.net. Musica, maestro, por favor. Just wait to instantation. 
the moment you feel the deep so when if and when you weather feel a lonely splash just come and dance mambo all the times mambo latino le traigo el mambo le traigo el mambo latino ay que sabroso bit of mambo here on the Latin Jazz Show with yours truly, the voice of Latin Jazz. And that particular set was brought to you by Mr. Willie Don Pepin de la Salsa, one of the fantastic producers and curators, curators of Latin Jazz curators. and Salsa. Uh, the, cur <laughs> the curators of Latin Jazz and Salsa. What a collection he has. And Willie will be coming to the Latin Jazz Show during the week now where you can listen to Willie's collection and you'll have more information about that in the near future. I want to remind everyone that this show is produced and sponsored by Master and Sons Plumbing. Master and Sons Plumbing, second generation of fine service. Let the masters do it right. 804-323-0202. 323-0202. If you want the job done, hey, call Master and Sons Plumbing, your plumbing and drain cleaning experts. No se olviden. A llamar su plomero latino preferido, 804-323-0202. Trabajo con garantía 24 horas al día. Master and Sons Plumbing, your plumbing and drain cleaning experts. Masterandsonsplumbing.com. We also have River City Communications, audio, video, design, plasma screens, Home theory of video surveillance, computer networks, sales. Wait a minute. Sales and service. Hello, you're on the air. We're having a problem with that. Hello. It's the second call. We've not been able to pull. Uh -huh. Esta gente tan loca. ¿Qué pasa aquí? All right. 
River City Communications with Mr. David Aponte. Uh, David Aponte, Operations Manager, 804-304-9590. 304-9590. And we have a little announcement here from David Aponte. Coge el teléfono, coge el teléfono, antes de que yo lo ensaje. Coge el teléfono. Ajá, ¿quién llama? Sí, ¿cuál cabezón está llamando? El viejo, el viejito de la iglesia de Santo Yo. Ok, ese, ese no está contestando, ese está colectando. Ok, este, mudando aquí a Artán, Miss Hispanic Team 2012, Hispanic American Sport Academy present, te invita a participar el concurso para reinado adolescente de la comunidad hispana. La ganadora representaría a la, la comunidad hispana del centro de Virginia por el periodo de un año. Eventos serían el 3 de marzo del 2012, presentación de los participantes, primero de abril de 2012. 2012, el show de talento que sería right. entonces el 26 de mayo del 2012. De yeah, we play the host, the host. Play the host 30 de julio de 2012, desfile de trajes de, de gala. El 4 de agosto 2012, el gran final. Informes y contactos sería Jackie Kemper, 804-245-7708. Yolanda. Chilín, 804-901-6385, Vilma Blanco, 804-955-5590, Juan Tejeda, 804-677-8000. Ahí está el desfile de la Hispanic Team. Man, tú man, sabes thank you very man. much, man. Sí, sabe, sabe, tipo, es, es, sabe, una, sabe dos o tres cosas, man. Yo Miss creía Hispanic que era un alfabeta de ella. Miss Hispanidad, uh -huh. Team Hispanidad 2012. Ladies and gentlemen, Hispanic American Sports Academy, ASA. And uh, this is going to be, this is a beautiful thing for the community, for the young ladies. It's a way to connect with them with the Latin community and the community at large. Although it's a Hispanic event, you do not be, have to be Hispanic to attend the the, uh, the banquet once it happens. So you can call us up. And you can also call Mike Lebron at 914-1944. Uh, I've been uh, blessed to be on the board for ASA and uh, just do a little public relations work for them. And also I am gonna be the MC for the entire event. So uh, we're gonna be there in force the entire uh, uh, staff of the Latin Jazz Show will be there, and I and without mentioning Lou will be there. Cause Lou is, is usually pushing me for these community events. Uh, he doesn't miss one, and uh, I want to. I'd like to, you know, impromptu ask Lou about a little organization that he's been involved with called the Matrix, and give us a little update about the Matrix, Lou. Well, I'm glad you asked me about that because it's a grassroots organization, and what it's dealing with, it's the procurement process that the cities throughout the country have, particularly this one, we, it's a grassroots that started here in Richmond, and how the process of procuring contracts affect the small businessman, particularly minority businesses, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? And we have made a, quite a bit of changes in how the city of Richmond does business with small businesses and minority contractors. And there's still a lot of ways to go, but we have made some differences. Made an impact. Yeah, we've made an impact, and uh, things are changing. Uh, the mayor of Richmond City, Richmond City Mayor, Mayor Jones, Dwight Jones, is 100%. As a matter of fact, he showed up at City Council and apologized to the people of Richmond, apologized to the contractors, and apologized to City Council for not recognizing what the Met Matrix Network was trying to uh, teach them on what the laws are when it comes to Section 3. And how the laws have been... Uh, uh, neglected and ne manipulated. Great yeah. word, neglected and manipulated. Yeah, neglected and manipulated to suit those that are in power. Mm -hmm. But, uh, buddy, you know, buddies, buddy, buddy the, wheel, the wheels of justice grind slowly, but they do grind. And we are making a change. And hopefully in the near future, the parity of, uh, 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 of contracts will be more even and given throughout the, the business uh, community. And, you know, uh, small contractors like myself, Master and Sons Plumbing, uh, like uh, River City Communications, we can benefit from what the city governments and state governments have to offer in terms of contract. Now, we're not talking just construction. We're talking uh, procurement. We're talking about purchasing. We're talking about 
all sorts of things. Why does the city of Richmond have to purchase stationary paper from a contractor who's based out of the state of Virginia? You understand? These are the changes yes. that we want to take place. Why does the city of Richmond have to hire contractors outside the city of Richmond when you have well-qualified contractors, minority contractors, based in the city and in the state of Richmond? So this is part of what Section 3 is a law. It's a federal law that many people and many municipalities haven't been uh, uh, listening to or adhering to. And you're correct about that. And I'm going to tell you something about this is that uh, I, my company is a small minority company here in Richmond, Virginia. And I've been in business for, let's say, 10, close to 15 years. And lately, matter of fact, just starting this last year, I had my first contract with the city of Richmond. Yeah. And my company was able to pick the fire station, the brand new fire station at right here on Sims Avenue. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, and you know, I'm, I'm, I'm glad that people like you is helping do this because it's helping my company be able to get contracts like this. Well, you know, people don't understand the law of Section 3. It's a federal law. And you know what they say, if you want to hide information, put it in a book. That's right. Because people don't read it. Well, actually, the mayor didn't know what Section 3 was. City Council President, Ms. Graziano, didn't know what Section 3 was. Uh, the, the, sex, the city council didn't know what Section 3 was. So uh, we took the time out to educate the city of Richmond. We actually had uh, uh, an investigation done by Washington, and, uh, and people came down to teach the city of Richmond what Section 3 means. And sex Section 3 actually means that if you're a minority business, and you are part of the Section 3 qualifications that you should be considered above everyone else for the city procurement and city contracts. And that's just a small, uh, a short synopsis on what it is. But ladies and gentlemen, look into what Section 3 is, or contact, go to thematrixnetwork.info, thematrixnetwork.info, for more information on your procurement, more information for uh, city contractors and businessmen to have the opportunity to do business with the city of Richmond. Ladies and gentlemen, you're listening to the voice of Latin Jazz. Yeah, Sweet let, me, let, let, let me, you know, I, you know, and I stepped out of the room for a minute because that was the people from, from the Hispanic Association calling to make sure that we were following up and, and giving them a shout out. And it's almost all covered. Huang is really on, in a sector car. He was supposed to call in today. He says, I, I feel uncomfortable calling from when I'm working. He may be in the, he's right on Hull Street, so he may drop in. The, heel, the do drop in? The do drop in. <laughs> but anyway, the Matrix Network, and uh, give us an, a phone number again, Lou, for the Matrix Network. Well, and, you can and call me. You can call me at 804-323-0202, 323-0202. I am the plumbing trade specialist for the Matrix Network, and I can get you in contact with the staff and the president and everyone else Great. that's involved. And this is good for small businessmen and minority business. It's, it's not a color law. The law of Section 3 is not a minority law. It's a people law. It's a small business. It, just be, just it small became a minority thing, which was... It, it never became a minority thing. To it, them. Just, it, just, it, it just happens to be that the majority of small businesses are, 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 affected. are, are, are affected by Section okay, 3. Cool. They just don't know it, and the good, the good, the good old... But what is it? The good old, good old boys network. Good old boys network. Yeah, man. the good old boy network is uh, being slowly but surely dismantled. Yep, yep absolutely. And uh, you know, we'll, we'll in well, the future we'll see better benefits. You, you, you know, from Mayor that. Dwight Jones. He's also a pastor, and he's got his heart in the right place. Politics is what it is, but he sort of handles balances that pretty well. Well, I don't agree with that, Mike. I really don't agree with that at all. I don't agree that uh, you can be you. You know, the the separation of church and state was uh, was one of the founding issues that the founding fathers wanted to be. So you can't serve two masters. And uh, that is one of the religious dogmas, that you can't serve two masters. And I find it very difficult for people who are of the, of the cloth, or the preachers, or priests, or reverends, or pastors, or anything, to that they, they are able to separate the church and state. You understand? So it's very difficult. As a matter of fact, uh, right now, Mayor Dwight Jones is caught in a controversy where one of the contractors that was awarded a huge contract for the city of Richmond has also the contractor that built and repaired the church that Dwight Jones preaches in 
for practically nothing. So that is an investigation, an ongoing investigation, and those are the things that get involved. But uh, Mayor Dwight Jones' commitment for the involvement of minority contractors to be at 30 percent is something to really be proud about. I think he's trying hard to go after that, you know what I mean? Uh, you know, I, I like keeping the feet, their feet to the fire. I like keeping politicians' feet to the fire because uh, a lot of the things that they do are, are, you know, if you're a politician, you know when they're talking bullshit is when their lips are moving. So you know what I mean? <laughs> well, that, that's, a, that's an arena that once you cross that bridge and you get into politics, you're yeah. part of the system. Right on. And you inherit a lot of nonsense. Right on. And uh, God, God bless you, you know, and, as being an advocate. But keep it, stay as an advocate because once you cross that, that, well, that turf, you know you don't belong to yourself anymore. You know, you know, I, you, you know. I, I, that's what he I, did. I, so, I know, you know. I, I know exactly what you mean. Been there, done that. I know, exa done that. I know exactly what you mean on that. And my, my thing is to expose the truth and to help the community as much as possible. This is the voice of Latin jazz, bringing you the best of Latin jazz here on WCLM Radio. And what do we got going, Roberto Ruena? Too loco, loco. Y tu loco, loco, only here on the Latin Jazz Show. Música, maestro, por favor. Tú eres el mismo de siempre. Tú estás loco. Yo, tú loco, loco, pero yo tranquilo.
Qué chévere. ¿eh? Bueno, este es el caballero empezó la primera etapa de la producción para el 1969 y por aquel momento tú tenías unos vecinitos, tú, tú nada más, todo el grupo. Y a ti te curé Alonso, se le antojó para esa persona cantarle esto. ¡Para Chotorro todo lo dice, Chotorro todo lo habla, Chotorro todo lo cuenta. Mezcla de chota y cotorro, Chotorro todo lo dice, Chotorro todo lo habla, Chotorro todo lo cuenta. Mezcla de chota y cotorro, y va yo con mi pollito, que la huevo entendí ayer. Chotorro me divisó, se lo contó a mi mujer. Meterse en tu vida y lanzarte por el chorro, donde quiera que tú vivas. Alguien sirve de chotorro, chotorro todo lo dice, chotorro todo lo habla. Chotorro todo lo dice, Chotorro todo lo habla, Chotorro todo lo cuenta. Mezcla de chota y cotorro.
Wow, that was the two coco loco yo tranquilo there by Mr. Roberto Ruena, that last video here on the Latin Jazz Show. That was three songs that we had there. What were those songs there, buddy? <laughs> call, call me, call me sleep, man. Call me sleep, man. We call him sleep, man. Let's get move on, moving right along. <laughs> no hay otra emisora que toca el tipo de música que se oye aquí. <laughs> Era, era, tú loco, loco, yo tranquilo, el traqueteo Chotorro. Socorro, mira. Socorro. Oh, vamos para la casa de Socorro. <laughs> it, it, you know what? And that was Roberto Roena. And the Apollo Sound. And let me tell you something, man. Looking at the video, uh, 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 the DVD here, I mean, these guys are sharp as a tack, brother. You know, with their white uh, tuxes. You see that, Lou? Yeah, that's pretty you cool. Know, that is pretty cool, man. You know, that guy looks like uh, Ricky Martin, but that's okay. Just tune you know? in to www.thelatinjazzshow.net for live video and audio. Wait a minute, we got somebody. Hello, you're on the air. Hello, you're on the air. Nope. Well, well I guess we have uh, uh, the new wire man, but he can't see the wire of the phone. I'm you telling know, you. Yeah, but you know, I said that this board is from uh, 1852. De los años de la guacara. When they were using, they were using coconuts and wires and, and, and ropes and stuff to communicate, man, you know. But this is the Latin Jazz Show. We are here till 10 o'clock. This is from 6 to 10 o'clock every Friday. So tune in uh, to www.thelatinjazzshow.net, and uh, you can listen to the best the best, the very best of Latin jazz and salsa in the universe. Willie Don Pepin de la Salsa, Jimmy Sabol Castro, Rangel Bustamante, Ralph Roldan, Security, DJ Eddie, David Aponte Jr. And senior, senior. or oh, senior. Yes. And uh, Miguelito Lebron, and none other than Sweet Lou Hidalgo in the pit, the voice of Latin jazz and our, and our uh, new mentor, and our, our bearing arms here is none other than Uncle Joe. Jose Uncle Antonio Joe. What Figueroa. What Tío Jose, yo lo que tengo que decir que este show está bien, bien bravo. La música está bien sabrosa. All right, that's what I'm talking about, man. This is from a, this is from a, not only a listener and a guest, but, but also an affectionado of music. He, t you know, the man is a, uh, I know he's a jack of all trades, but he also can dance, his tail off. He's been here moving around. You're going to need a little oxygen after he finishes. But uh, we have a little bit of music to play, man. Well, wait a minute. You know that uh, Uncle Joe can sing, too, you know. Oh, yeah? Hey, Joe, you want to get a couple of lyrics in there, buddy? te dieron que fue en el mismo día que te fuiste. Ella entró a mi lugar. No te mentieron. Que fue en los mismos momentos que tu despedida. No me esperaba. No me dejes. Sin preguntar, abrió la puerta y entró en mi alma. Y aprovechó. Why are you touching me? De mi nostalgia. Ay, coño. Hoy me acompaña. Vaya. <laughs> wow, man, that was dynamite, Uncle Joe. He does have a sweet voice, man, you know, but you should sing low. So low, nobody can hear you. But it's okay. <laughs> Way to go, and, man. And David, please tell me you don't sing. No, he no canta. No canta. Gracias. Ay, Dios mío. ¿Qué está hablando con Miguelito? No, Tony to Matos. Oh, Tony Matos, pero who's he talking about? <laughs> Hi, Tony. Hi, Tony. We love you. Hi, <laughs> right, man. 
Guido, I'm happy to hear your health is more than you know, man. My health is much better. Thank well, you, my better. brother. God bless you for asking, man. Yeah. I love this guy. Amen to you, I my love brother. this guy. God bless cool. you, man. I love you guys, bro. I love you too. Thank hey, you, I'm, man. I'm looking, I'm looking at three screens. The fourth screen is off, bro. Oh yeah, that because that's that's the dirty that's the dirty movies. Don't put that old man on there no more, bro. Because I'm gonna switch. Because I see I see a picture of him on Facebook and he looks kind of gay. Can you repair marriages? No, because I'm going through my own crap myself. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got diarrhea. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> we love you, Tony. I love you guys, man. I'm glad you're there, man. I'm there with you in spirit, bro. Amen. Thank and you, man. You so Let's give Tony. Man. Theo, I love you, Theo. All right, yeah. give him a big yeah. hand. Come on. Yeah, yeah buddy. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we're having a problem here with the phones, but we were able to get Antonio Matos calling in from Kissimmee, Florida. If you uh, need any plumbing work out there, call at TriStar Plumbing. Ask for Mr. Antonio Matos. Only here on the Latin Jazz Show do you get the best of Latin Jazz and Salsa every Friday from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. for your listening pleasure on WCLM Radio. And let's continue with Roberto Ruena and the sounds of salsa.
persona que cuando yo tuve que partir, un muchacho muy bueno, un gran cantante puertorriqueño, a él le entregué mi micrófono, Tito Cruz. Muchas gracias, Piro. Muchas gracias. Buenas noches. Me siento fresco y con este fresco que me refresca cantando voy a mi tierrita que es tan bonita con esta brisa rimando el sol tú me acaricias amor y que es linda y esto no existe que en realidad en monte adentro que bien me siento y esto no es puesto yo soy un ibaro de borinquen
Me siento fresco y con este fresco que me refresca cantando voy a mi tierrita que está That's some good stuff you got going there, Mr. David Aponte, bringing us a little bit of Roberto Ruena, live video concert from Puerto Rico. No hay otra emisora que toca el tipo de música que se oye aquí. Todos los viernes, desde las 6 de la tarde hasta las 10 de la noche, para ustedes, mi gente, la música, la cultura, el espíritu de nuestros padres on the Latin Jazz Show. 
Ladies and gentlemen, yours truly, the voice of Latin jazz, Sweet Louis Hidalgo, bringing you the best of Latin jazz and salsa every Friday with my main man, Miguelito El Guido Lebron, aquí on WCLM Radio, the Latin jazz show, where you can see and hear the live music and the live videos of the Latin jazz show. www.thelatinjazzshow.net, bringing you the best of Latin jazz and salsa every Friday. Here on WCLM Radio.
4 de la mañana todo ayudaba con su hijo la negra estaba borracha peleando con su marido la negra estaba borracha peleando con su marido la negra linda se esta danza buena se traba esta negra linda se traba para bailar mi son mira que se traba la negra linda se traba se traba 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 mi son esta negra linda se traba 
decías que ya no servía Oye tú que decías que ya no salía Ahora mismo mi hermano yo te vengo a saludar Escucha, escucha Oye sonar las trompetas, oye los cueros sonar Ricardo viene de frente con su sonido bestial
Hey, man, what do you think what? about what we just saw there? Wow. Ricardo Ray, Richie Ray, Bobby Cruz. Classic. The classic, classic. thing is, that, you know, Sonido Bestial. And you know what? It's so nice. We got to play it twice, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Stay tuned while Mr. David Aponte is resetting up the Sonido Bestial. This next tune that you're going to see on the video is going out to my aunt Rose Figueroa. We love you, Rosie, very much. Mucho beso y abrazo. Do not leave that screen because what you're going to see is going to bring back a lot of memories. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the voice of Latin jazz, Sweet Louis Hidalgo, bringing you the best of Latin jazz every Friday from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. for your listening pleasure on WCLM Radio with my main man, Miguelito El Guido Lebron, trayéndole la mejor de la música latina y la salsa here on the Latin Jazz Show, the station where we don't speak English. And we don't speak Spanish. We speak Spanglish. Every Friday <laughs> from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. for your listening pleasure on WCLM Radio, 1450 on your AM dial, or just go to www.thelatinjazzshow.net. Thelatinjazzshow.net for the best in Latin jazz and salsa every Friday from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. for your listening pleasure. Do not forget July 21st. July 21st, the 6th Annual Latin Jazz and Salsa Festival at Bird Park from six from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. on the uh, Festival of the Arts. Festival of the Arts program, right. City of Richmond, Festival okay. of the Arts. And it's the 6th Annual Latin Jazz Show Festival concert. That's right. And this is going to be a special uh, debut of another segment of the way we present ourselves out there in the general public. It's going to be uh, a different and yet it's going to be better. So put on your calendar July the 21st, which is a Saturday evening, and we won't have that hot sun beating down on us. Fue tremendo el año I, I, I passed out. I damn near passed out. <laughs> well, you they did. They had to help me off the stage. Well, you, went, you did. That's I why you had a different shirt on. Up. I cramped up. <laughs> <laughs> but but it's going to be fantastic. And uh, and uh, just put it, on your, put it on your calendar because it's going to be Melena, Herman Oliveira, Frankie Morales, uh, Herbie Martinez and his band, and much, much more. So, uh, Lou, I'm looking forward to Pongan it. Pongan su calendario, pon el calendario Julio 21, el Festival Séptimo, Festival de Latin Jazz y Salsa at Bird Park. Don't miss it. Be there or be square. No hay otra emisora que le toca el tipo de música que se oye aquí. Todos los viernes desde las 6 de la tarde hasta las 10 de la noche, mi gente. The Latin Jazz Show, bringing you the best of Latin jazz and salsa every Friday here on the Latin Jazz Show. And we just played the video of Sonido Bestial, which the radio listeners were able to hear it, but the internet viewers were oh, able to see it. it. Wow. And, you know, we are not corporate radio. We do this as a labor of love. We can do what we want here on the Latin Jazz yes. Show. So it was so nice. We're we going to play twice. it twice here on WCLM Radio. Richie One Ray. more time. Bobby Cruz, Sonido Bestial. Vaya. Decías 
que ya no servía, oye tú que decías que ya no salía. Ahora mismo mi hermano yo te vengo a saludar. Oye sonar las trompetas, oye los cueros sonar Ricardo viene de frente con su sonido bestial
This is the Latin Jazz Show on WCLM Radio, 1450 on your AM dial. We are coming to the end of the program today. What a fantastic show brought to you by Master and Sons Plumbing, CIS Investments, and, and Community, excuse me, <laughs> and River City Communications with Mr. David Aponte, Joseph Antonio Figueroa, Miguelito El Guido Lebron, Sweet Lou Hidalgo, sus servidores aquí on the Latin Jazz Show. Miles de besos y abrazo a todo el mundo allá afuera que están oyendo y viendo el programa de hoy. The Latin Jazz Show will be here next Friday for your listening and viewing pleasure. No hay otra emisora que toca el tipo de música que se oye aquí. Todos los viernes desde las 6 de la tarde hasta las 10 de la noche para ustedes. The Latin Jazz Show. Good night, ladies and gentlemen. Abrácense mucho, quiérense mucho y, y, y participen en este show el próximo viernes de las 6 a las 10 de la noche con Sweet Lou, Miguel El Guiro. Hasta la próxima. Que Dios me lo bendiga. David Aponte. Joe, say good night. Good night. Buenas noches. Buenas noches to everybody. All right. God bless you, Sweet Lou. Hasta la próxima. See you on the radio next Friday. Bye.
Ok, todavía tenemos unos segunditos ahí. Silencio, está durmiendo. Put a couple of dollars in my front pocket 